too, man. As y'all can see, your boy's in a truck. Uh. Anyways, man, I, I was gonna vlog. I'm trying to vlog. I'm trying to stay consistent. I'm trying to do good things, right? And it's just like, as soon as you wanna lock in and all that, something bad happened, man. Let me show y'all what's going on. From right here, hold on, matter of fact, so from right here, you can see it looks like just a simple blowout, right? Just a simple blowout. No, it's a blowout, which mind you, these are brand new tires. Look at, look at this. These are brand new tires that I just got put on here, bro. And it's a blowout, but look what happened. When a tire blew out, it hit the airbag and put a hole in the airbag. So now that's causing me? Oh my goodness, bro. Oh my goodness, bro. I can't really tell, but the trailer is now lopsided because there's no air supporting it. Ugh. My bad, y'all. I'm... Let, we gotta get this figured out, bro. All right, y'all. So we got a new tire put on. There's still a hole in the airbag. We just bypassed it to where the air, the truck will still just basically hold air. But there's a new tire on, truck holding air. This load is pretty heavy, 44,000. I know it's about to be a rough ride up to Philly, but it's gonna be all right. And I have no fuel. I am at a pilot right now, but guess what? I don't do pilots. I mean, I'm at a Loves right now, and I usually get fuel at pilots, so. We're about to go ahead and head to the pilot. Which, the pilot is literally the next exit up, but when my tire broke, I just came here for Loves, and I didn't even end up getting my shit replaced by them. There's that. Oh man, how y'all doing, bro? It's been a minute. So I've been up on up on that thing. Yeah, man. I don't get why there's a stop sign right there. I wasn't abiding by it. Ain't nothing that way. Bro, I don't know how I let my fuel get this low either. It just happens. Now I put my pad pad back up there. That's something to watch. does indeed go on buddy yeah that's a pretty dog y'all want to get a dog for the truck but i just man the one time to piss in this truck and you're gonna be left on the side of the highway i'm not gonna lie to you gang that's a rider truck that's crazy but i am indeed about to pull up at the pilot so I ain't gonna hold y'all up too much. We merging on the highway. We're gonna get through it. Get through it. I guess I'll see y'all when we pull up at the pie pie. Alright, here we at. We done pulled up to the pie pie. So let's get it. How much is diesel? 355. Not too much. Chillin'. Yeah, we only got 23 days left in a month already. All right, eight nine one one five eight.
do a quick walk around. Everything look good, smell good, taste good. Uh, glide. Make sure my ceiling shit's still on here. Wow. Usually I can look at my tires and tell they straight. Sometimes I be thrown off. Look at the height difference of these tires, bro. It's only a little bit, but you can definitely tell the height difference, bro. These, cause this is a brand new one. But, Get all this stuff ready. I know I don't need to be eating this, but I eat it anyway. Not gonna lie to you, gang. Not gonna act like I'm the healthiest trucker around, but boy, am I not. Get all my snacks ready so I don't have to stop for the next eight hours. Ew, what the hell? Put this bottle on my door in case I need that later. Close up. Not happening right now, though. It's pretty charged up. Charged up. Headset. I don't be talking to nobody, so I probably won't need my headset. Talk to myself more than anything. Uh, well, I'm gonna need to change the battery. Boom, and now we are all set, ready to go for the road. Oh, almost messed up. I'll be having to put this on, cause when I turn, this whole refrigerator will fly open. Cause it's not like a truck refrigerator. Nah, <clears throat> sad. Sure, sad. Man, I want it to smell good before I take off. bad y'all y'all just got hit in the head um yeah no i'll see y'all when this fuel is finished and we getting ready back on the road Some stuff real quick and then I'll be ready to rock and roll about this about this thing guys. Uh, see what I'm saying? One eternity later. Boys you going as y'all can see it is the nighttime man south of the border right here so you know what that means I am in North Carolina now. You know what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? South of the border why it look like Toronto. Yes sir. I actually do want to go to Canada one day hopefully I can you know what I'm saying? 
you know what I'm saying? It's a little cool over there. That's called South of the Border Truck Stop, if y'all want to look it up. Um, right here, we just banged into North Carolina right here. I forgot to pick up the camera when I had left. I just had so much other stuff going on. But now, we are good. And we are rolling. Who calling me? My mama. I'll chat back in with y'all after I get off the phone with my mama, though. All right, y'all. I just ended up making um me a little pit stop because... I'm not making a pit stop because I do indeed want to eat a burger tonight and I don't have any buns. So, uh, and I want a burger. So we just made it here to the neighborhood Walmart. Just slammed my truck right on the sides. I like those. You know what I'm saying? I wish this was a better Walmart because I wanted to get some other stuff, but I don't really need it. So I ain't too much tripping. Oh, I'm about to make me a cool little, cool little dinner tonight. I'm gonna be straight. I ain't really hungry right now, but I am going to want it later. So I was like, well, might as well stop right now. That way later when I do stop, I'll be gravy. Nah, see what I'm saying? We go neighborhood Walmart. I don't want to eat no McDonald's, but I really want a burger, but it gotta be like, a good homemade burger, you know what I'm saying? Shoot what I'm saying. Let me run up in this. Let's grab everything we need and we'll be right back. Thing good. Yes, sir. Got everything. The longest thing was the dang on line. Like, what the heck? What the heck? Big truck sitting right there waiting on me. Anyway, let's get back on the road. All right, y'all, so with the matter of about 30 seconds, I ain't gonna lie, I did change my mind. I'm about to go ahead and cook up this burger, man, because why not just eat right now so I can just dry. You know what I'm saying? So I'm about to cook up this burger. I'm gonna run over McDonald's, and I am gonna get some McDonald's fries, but I'm gonna eat this burger. All right, y'all, this one I'm seasoning the burger with steak sauce and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah? I wish y'all could smell this burger, I ain't gonna lie. Fries acquired. And it was free. It was free. Look, see, this ain't cooked. This, that's what I be knowing. Gotta know what's going on. Gotta know what's going on. So we're gonna let that cook a little bit more. Then we're gonna eat. All right, y'all, the burger finished cooking. Got all the fat off the sides. Nice and brown how I like it. Fries set up and the fries is free. Got my mayo and only like a little bit of ketchup. But, you know what I'm saying? Boom. That's hot. Man, and just like that, dinner is served. And look at this. In less than, can y'all see that? In less than 20 minutes. I mean, in less than 30 minutes, bro. In less than 30 minutes, bro. I just chefed up a meal. And by the time I'm done with this, my 30 minute break will be up and I have a fresh clock. Let's get it. Now y'all know it's only right that I take the first bite with y'all, boy. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna bite this. I'm gonna bite that corner right there. You see that? Oh, we. Oh. What? Off the McDonald's fry? Hey. 10 out of 10. We're doing it again. Push warming table put away. Got me some chips. Got me a water. And now we are all good. So I'm about to take off and let's do it. How long we got, y'all? Oh, we not getting there to 4.35 in the morning. We got seven hours. I won't have to stop at all anymore because I have a full clock. So we good. What's going? What's going? What's going, y'all? We have just made it over here to uh Richmond, Virginia. We're in the city right now, which not too bad, man. I got four hours left. I love running through the night, bro. I love it. Like I only encountered one ignorant driver so far, and it was, I just went around them just because they was just being ignorant. But we are in Richmond, Richmond, Virginia, and I think both of these lanes are about to close, if I'm not mistaken. So. Go ahead and get over. You know what I'm saying? 
Yo, I don't like Virginia. Virginia is so long for no reason. Virginia and Ohio just seem so long. So I just hate being in either one of them, if I'm being honest. As y'all can see, the rich beside over there, though. Mm. I don't know why I'm yawning. I ain't even tired, for real. And it's, it's been, the police and the construction has been crazy, I will admit. But that's also, like I did run into a little bit of traffic earlier, but it was literally because of construction. And as y'all know, they always do construction at night. But there's also less people on the road at night. I know this idiot better stop. You better, so you better stop. Thank you, buddy. Uh, boy, what a big cook, boy. Cause I had no intention on stopping. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Speed limit 55 and I was going less than that. Yeah, you, and I'm freaking 40 in the box. No, sir. Well, yeah, man. I've been wanting to chat with y'all anyway, man. I missed y'all. I'm uh, trying to be consistent on here, trying to stay uh, up to date on here. Um, Cause boy, I've been slacking off. Oh, it says right lane closed, bro. That's embarrassing. I hate when I get over and then like, the, I gotta get back over. You know what I'm saying? It's cool though. I'll get back over in a second. I need, I need bro to stop riding on the side of me. If you gonna go, just go past me. I'm heavy. Maybe he heavy too though, so that's probably why. I hate a 55 speed limit. It's you know, so annoying. Oh, I missed y'all. I missed y'all tremendously. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, that's a cool little soccer field. Oh, as y'all know, winter is coming up too, bro. And I'm not working this winter, bro. Snap. Look at this idiot. Why he just wanna run on the side, bro? I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? Like, why do you want to ride on the side of me, twin? There's a lot of other places. You can ride on the side. Why are these trucks going so fast? And the speed limit 55. I'm already going 65. So that means they going. I don't know. I'm going at least like 70 right here. Got it. I also was looking into um I was looking at it, getting my tanker's license, but I'm good. I'm good. What lane that in? Let's see how fast he's going. I told you he was going 70. I literally knew it, bro. It says lane in and one mile. What do you oh you getting off? Say that. Going seven. I pick up this camera and just start yawning, bro. I promise y'all, I'm not tired at all. Bored? Yes. Tired? Absolutely not. I'm glad I'm going through this place at nighttime because Richmond, during the day, oh my goodness, I would have been sitting there mad as heck in freaking traffic. And then I also gotta go somewhere to Maryland. I don't know what part of Maryland, and I don't wanna say the wrong part, so I ain't gonna say no part at all. But I know I do gotta go through a part of Maryland that um, that would have dumb traffic during the day, so yeah. And also, oh, ooh, why is car being stupid? You matched it. You fucking map go, dumbass. Fucking idiot. Wanna just sit? Who sits on the side of a truck, bro? Yes, I saw that the trucks was coming up and that I need to get over, but they was sitting right there the whole time. I didn't want to get behind them. Currently on the 95, about to hop on the 495. And the part of Maryland I was talking about earlier was Baltimore that I had to go to, Baltimore, Maryland. 
and, and it get wicked over there. But this highway right here, oh my goodness. If y'all saw this like during the day, or if I would've waited until like five, six o'clock in the morning, all these lanes would be freaking backed up, man. So I'm just happy I am getting it done now. You know what I'm saying? Um, we did have a little bit of a rough start. You know, it's episode one. As y'all know, I'm doing 60 days OTR. Uh, I'm doing, if y'all, I haven't really explained the title of the videos and everything, but I am doing 60 days OTR. But for y'all, it'll be 30 days. But it's 60 days, but for y'all, it's 30 days because I'm gonna, uh, every video is gonna be two days because I may be doing the same load the second day and I don't wanna bore y'all with that. You know what I'm saying? So it gives me enough time to be on to the next load, going to the next place, doing the next thing. So that's the whole point of 60 days OTR. And um, yeah, it's just like a series. And instead of dropping an episode like every week, you know, where I just give y'all like a weekly update or whatever going on, I can do it every two days. That'll give y'all a couple of videos every week. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can't see, but well, you can on here, all the water and stuff. Right now we're in, and I think Baltimore. Where are we? Let's see. I guess, yeah, we're in Baltimore. But as you can see, we're about to be surrounded by water and we're about to go under water, if that makes sense. So now we're really about to be surrounded. Hey, what's on them big old shit? Hey, I don't like this, bro. I hate being around water, bro. Oh my goodness. Sorry. Sorry, y'all. We booch. Alright y'all, y'all see this is all water. Now watch. It was cheaper, or not probably cheaper, but more convenient for them to go in the water instead of above the water and build the bridge. So it's like an underwater bridge. Four four. I'm literally about to throw up. Oh my goodness. I hate this. And we ain't even went under the water yet. And now we are under the freaking water, bro. Oh, I wouldn't say I have a fear of water, but I damn sure don't like being under it. I don't like being grounded. And I know I'm complaining about water, but I just don't like it, bro. I just have something I can get with. That's why I'm speeding through this tunnel, I'm trying to just hurry up and just get up out of here. Oh, imagine being stuck in traffic in this tunnel. Yeah. GG's. Cutty bone. Cutty bone. I wish y'all could see my skin. I literally got goosebumps. We got two hours left, bro. The time did go up because uh, I missed the turn. I don't lie to you. Well, I didn't really miss the turn. It kind of like, you know how like the GPS to like direct you one way and then once you get to that point that it's directing you to, it wants you to go the other way. That's really what happened. So I didn't really, I, I did miss the turn, but it wasn't like to no fault of my own. And that was like last minute and I was cooked and I was like, uh, yeah. Hold up. I also just thought about like stopping and chilling because I have plenty of time. But I'd rather just get there at 5 in the morning and just chill till then, you know? That's what I'd rather do. 
I don't want to drive in no traffic, bro. I ain't driving in traffic. And I ain't got to worry about no way stations. Like, I just be, it's just, it's just better for me to keep going overall. But it's the deal. Good morning, man. As y'all can see, it is the next day. I've been here for a minute, bro, and they just, they tweaked out on me, bro. I've been here over 50 minutes. Nobody, like, I've been, I checked in everything, waiting on the gate and all that. Nobody really said nothing. It is what it is. I ain't too much tripping on it. Uh, I'm about to brush my teeth, though, because, boy, you really need to brush his teeth. I hate brushing, I hate not being at the truck stop and not being able to brush my teeth. But, you a trucker, you gotta work with what you got. Yeah, yeah. Right there, water bottle right here. Take this. That was the water. Good to pay. I ain't gonna lie. Take care of yourself when you over this road, man. It's easy. It, people don't really talk about it, bro. It's really easy to let yourself go over this road. Like at home, you know, it's easy. To, if you just, uh, if you're a clean person, you good. But I ain't gonna lie. It's easy to let yourself go. You'll just be in the truck rotting away. And I can admit, I was probably brushing my teeth once a day, bro. At home, two, three times a day. You know what I'm saying? But like in a truck, it was just in the morning, quick, boom. But I'm gonna take care of myself, good boy. I don't like feeling like this, man. I really don't. But I'm about to check in with these folks, man. Once we get a doctor, I'm gonna tune y'all in. But we're gonna go talk to him and see what he's trying to see what he's trying to do for real. Six o'clock, bro. And it took them forever to get me unloaded. But right now, I'm gonna make me some chicken wings. That's why I be keeping food in the truck, bro. Cause like right now I don't, I don't even feel like going nowhere. I'm about to make some white castle chicken wings in here. And we're gonna call it a night, man. Thank y'all for tuning in. And I, I guess I'll show y'all what it look like when we done. Then I end the video. So let's go ahead and get cooking. All right, y'all. The chicken rings are done. I don't have ranch. I forgot the ranch, but I'm gonna get some cause I'm about to go to Walmart. But that's what I'm eating. Thank y'all for tuning in. I appreciate all y'all, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.